Hello everybody, welcome to a tropical update here. This is what's currently going on in the world of the tropics right now. Um, three things to talk about right now. Um, of course, first being uh, Tropical Cyclone 08S, also known as uh, uh, Danilo, I believe it's what it's called, or uh, yeah, Danilo, maybe? Uh, <laughs> I believe that's the pronunciation on it. I could be wrong. Uh, please correct me in the comments uh, if I'm wrong, but I believe it's Danilo, maybe. Um, and then we also caught uh, Invest 93S and Invest 94P ongoing. Uh, 94P has a low chance of development. Invest 93S, however, in the Southwest Indian Ocean has a medium percent chance, medium uh, chance at formation here. And you can see the key on the bottom of your screen there. Medium meaning tropical cyclone development likely, but expected to occur to occur beyond 24 hours. Low, of course, meaning tropical cyclone development unlikely within the next 24 hours. And then, of course, we've got tropical cyclone 08S, also known as Danilo. And uh, here's the latest forecast track for Danilo right now. Uh, currently a 40 knot system, which is about 45 miles per hour. So it's a tropical storm. Intensity tropical cyclone here, and it's forecast to peak as a 60 knot high end tropical storm, which uh, 60 knots is about 70 miles per hour. Um, as it uh, goes south and then takes a uh, kind of a southwest jog and maybe more more due west jog i should say um and that last uh, forecast point there as you can see and the reason why the track is kind of weird like this where it's kind of uh you know going like uh going southeast and due south and then southwest and then maybe due west here the last forecast point um is due to this here um a ongoing or, or if not ongoing, likely to be a Fujiwara effect between Invest 96S right here and uh, uh, Tropical Cyclone um, Danilo right here, as you can see. And this is Water Vapor Inventory uh, right now off of Mateosat uh, 8. And you get to see what uh, uh, the storms are currently doing right now. This is a loop over the, over the past 10 hours here. You can see a lot of dry air uh, to the system, to uh, the south of uh, all these systems here, these two systems, I should say, and um, to its north, of course, a really moist and favorable environment here. Um, so we'll see uh, what goes on with this. The, some models are forecasting um, 93S to become the, the, the stronger storm out of the two, but um, looks like maybe Danilo might be trying to make a run for its own here and maybe try to become the dominant system here uh, between the two. So we'll have to see about that. Here's infrared in imagery right now. Um, and you can see, again, the same thing. Uh, tropical cyclone uh, Danilo uh, continuing to intensify here and then Invest 93S gradually intensifying by the looks of it here on satellite imagery here. And again, we'll see which storm becomes the dominant one out of the two. But for now, it looks like maybe Danilo might be on a winning side at this point, uh, unlike what was previously thought about 24 hours ago from now in the last update. And then speaking of 93S, here's what 93S looks like up close on water vapor satellite imagery uh, from Himawari 8. And uh, you can see uh, not really much to look at here, just <laughs> pretty much just a big blob of convection, or a tiny blob of, blob of convection, I should say, compared to uh, Danilo there to its top uh, left there. And then here's visible satellite imagery of the System 2. And uh, you can see the sun's just starting to rise up over uh, 93S, and then of course soon uh, Danilo. And then here's a look at tropical, uh, uh, not tropical, uh, Invest 97P um, and the Gulf of Carpentaria um, in Australia here. And you can see it uh, starting to gradually um, pick up an organization here. And uh, at this point, has a low chance of development according to the JTWC, but of course that could change here. Again, the system roughly has about 36 or 48 hours to intensify here before it goes over land here, and the chances will uh, significantly diminish after that, of course, due to it being over land. Um, so, yeah, that's uh, Nidus RMP right there, and um, yeah, it might develop into a next the next uh, name system for this part of the world again. Invest in Nidus RMP. And uh, that's pretty much about it for this tropical update here. Again, the main thing to watch, of course, is Tropical Cyclone 08S, also known as Danilo. And um, uh, for now, it's forecast to stay at the sea. However, some models are kind of uh, hinting at a may threaten reunion um, or Mauritius, perhaps, later down the line in about a week week's time or so. Um, we'll have to see about that. But for now, just keep a close eye on it here. Don't, of course, panic about it. Um, listen to your local officials about it if they're telling you to, um, you know, pay attention to it. Um, uh, again, it, it's a really long way out in time, so this could stay far out from uh, Mauritius and Lower Union, or it could maybe 
become more of an impact than we initially think here. So just keep an eye on it here. Again, don't panic about it. Just keep keep close eye on it here and uh, stay aware of that this storm is uh, ongoing right now. So that's pretty much going to be about it for this tropical update here. Hope everybody has a great day and night. Because are, stay safe, of course. I uh, hope everybody had a great New Year's. Uh, if you have, if you, uh, have any questions or comments, then in the comment section below. And I'll try, to, I'll try to answer them to the best of my ability. And if you know, if you want to know what websites and links links that I use, this tropical update here, they're also down below, and you can click uh, on that stuff too, and uh, get uh, the latest information on tropical cyclones ongoing throughout the world, um, whenever you want. So again, that's probably gonna be about it for this tropical update here. Hope everybody has, again, ha hope everybody had a great New Year's. Uh, now we're in 2021, and hopefully 2021 is a lot more forgiving than 2020 ever was, and um, you know, hopefully it's gonna be a lot more. Uh, a, a better and positive year um, compared to what 2020 was. Um, so let's just hope for the best for uh, 2021 here. And again, hope everybody has a great day and night where we guys are. Stay safe, of course. Until then, see you guys in the next video. Peace.